you take a matrix multiply with its transpose to get the degree of correlation which results in something called gram matrix but why why we need this kind of process and what's its significance in this video we'll try to get that answer while going through this paper which takes an algorithmic approach for style transfer using convolutional neural network it uses gram matrix to capture style from paintings but this paper failed to explain why they are using this and how it works then a year after this paper another paper came up with the name demystifying neural style transfer which explained everything in detail which wasn't explained in the original paper but the explanation involves a lots of mathematics which if you are a beginner you may find it difficult to understand so in this video i'll try to explain visually with as little maths as possible this is a simple keras code to apply convolutional neural network on an image which will generate four different matrices which are called feature maps basically these matrices contains low level feature of an image like lines edges dots curves and if you perform deep convolution you will get some higher level features like shapes objects etc but for now let's stick with this now we know that different feature maps represent different feature of an image but these features are independent from each other so it can capture objects and shapes but cannot capture style of an image style refers to texture brush strokes color distribution etc whose occurrences are dependent on each other like in this example you can see how yellow circles appear in the final image because the algorithm knows that circle of yellow color with this texture appear together and this represents high correlation between yellow color texture and shape which is circle those all features are here in the form of feature matrices and if we can measure the degree of correlation between these matrices we can represent the style of an image for instance when feature 1 occurs feature 3 occurs too so the correlation between feature maps can be calculated using dot products with respect to each other so in order to do that first convert the feature maps into vector and multiply it with its transpose hence the resulting matrix will represent style of an image this matrix is called the gram matrix thanks for watching